Tom Selleck, the heartthrob of Magnum P.I. fame, known for his portrayal of tough yet compassionate characters and revered for his role in Blue Bloods, has captivated audiences for decades. His trademark mustache has become synonymous with rugged charm, and his performances stand as a testament to his undeniable talent. But behind the fame, did you know that he's kept his personal life private? He's even thought about stepping away from acting altogether. What could possibly make a legendary actor like Tom Selleck walk away from the glitz and glamour of Hollywood? There is actually an explanation for this question that has left fans shocked. But before delving into that, let's first explore the journey that led him to this point. Thomas William Selleck, popularly known as Tom Selleck, was born on January 29, 1945, in Detroit, Michigan. He was born to Martha Selleck and Robert Dean Selleck. His father, Robert, worked as an executive and real estate investor. Selleck grew up in a close-knit family environment alongside his elder brother Robert, younger sister Martha, and younger brother Daniel. Selleck's ancestry is primarily English, with some German heritage as well. His family roots trace back to English colonist David Selleck, who migrated to Massachusetts from Somerset, England, in 1633. Through this paternal lineage, Selleck belongs to the 11th generation of his family born in North America. In 1948, when Selleck was just three years old, his family relocated to Sherman Oaks, California. This move marked a significant change for the Selleck family, shaping Tom's early years and setting the stage for his future endeavors. Growing up in California, Selleck's childhood was influenced by the vibrant culture and opportunities of the West Coast. After graduating from Grant High School in 1962, Tom Selleck embarked on his academic journey enrolling at Los Angeles Valley College. Living at home and diligently saving money, he pursued his education while laying the groundwork for his future. Standing tall at 6 feet 4 inches, 1.93 min, Selleck's athletic prowess was undeniable, leading him to transfer to the University of Southern California during his junior year. At USC, he joined the esteemed USC Trojans men's basketball team, showcasing his skills on the court. In addition to basketball, Selleck displayed his versatility as an athlete by becoming a pitcher and designated hitter for the USC baseball team. His involvement extended beyond sports as he became a member of the Sigma Chi fraternity and the Trojan Knights, immersing himself in campus life. While pursuing a major in business administration, Selleck's path took an unexpected turn when a drama coach suggested he explore acting. In his senior year, Selleck made the bold decision to drop out of university and pursue acting full-time. Eager to refine his craft, he enrolled in acting classes at the prestigious Beverly Hills Playhouse under the tutelage of renowned acting coach Milton Katselis. However, just as Selleck was diving into his newfound passion, he received a draft notice during the Vietnam War. Responding to the call of duty, Selleck made the decision to join the California National Guard, serving in the 160th Infantry Regiment of the California Army National Guard from 1967 to 1973. Despite the challenges posed by military service, Selleck remained committed to his acting aspirations. After completing his military service in 1973, Tom Selleck was finally able to pursue acting full-time, marking the beginning of a new chapter in his career. Prior to his service, he had already made small appearances on shows like The Dating Game, laying the groundwork for his future in entertainment. Now, with his military duties behind him, Selleck was poised to immerse himself fully in the world of acting, bringing with him a wealth of life experiences and a newfound sense of purpose. Selleck's time in the military, coupled with his unwavering dedication to his craft, had prepared him for the challenges and opportunities that lay ahead. In the 1970s, he found his niche in the television landscape with a recurring role on The Rockford Files. His character, Lance White, captivated audiences with his charm and wit, earning Selleck recognition for his acting prowess. 
The success of the Rockford Files opened doors for Selleck, propelling him into the realm of movies. His rugged, outdoorsy appearance made him a natural choice for action and Western roles, leading to his iconic portrayal in Western films. In 1979, Selleck landed a significant role in his first Western film, The Sackets, a milestone moment in his career. Acting alongside esteemed Western legends like Sam Elliott and Glenn Ford, Selleck showcased his versatility and talent. The Sackets not only elevated Selleck's profile, but also provided him with invaluable experience working alongside seasoned actors. Building on this success, Selleck continued to ride the Western wave with the 1982 film The Shadow Riders, further establishing himself as a formidable presence in the industry. During this time, Tom's career reached a pivotal stage, significantly shaping his reputation as a leading actor in Western films. His portrayals resonated strongly with audiences who appreciated his genuine commitment to embodying Wild West characters. This dedication only served to enhance his popularity among fans. However, Tom's acting prowess extends beyond his cowboy persona. While he's best known for his Western roles, his career encompasses a diverse range of characters, showcasing his versatility as an actor. But Tom's repertoire extends far beyond portraying cowboys. One of his most celebrated roles is that of a law enforcement officer a character archetype intricately linked with his name in the realm of entertainment. Prior to this, he showcased his talents as a private investigator on the iconic television series, The Rockford Files. However, it was his breakout performance on the 1980 show Magnum P.I. that truly propelled him into the spotlight. In Magnum P.I., Tom embodied the role of Thomas Magnum, a suave and resourceful detective navigating the sun-drenched streets of Hawaii. Audiences were captivated by the character's charm, and Tom's portrayal showcased his remarkable acting prowess, establishing him as a bona fide television star. The series soared in popularity, enjoying a successful run of eight seasons and elevating Tom to household name status. In recognition of his exceptional work, he even clinched an Emmy Award in 1984 for his contributions to the show. Yet, despite the immense success of Magnum P.I., there were sacrifices along the way. Tom found himself passing up the opportunity to portray the iconic character Indiana Jones due to his commitments to Magnum P.I. After eight fruitful seasons, Tom made the heartfelt decision to bid farewell to Magnum P.I., embarking on new ventures both within and beyond the realm of acting. Reflecting on his decision, Selleck expressed pride in honoring his contract for Magnum, highlighting the importance of integrity and commitment to his family values. Despite missing out on the iconic Indiana Jones role, Selleck embraced his portrayal of Thomas Magnum, a former Navy SEAL-turned-private investigator living in Hawaii. Amidst his professional journey, Tom's personal life also underwent significant changes. In 1987, he embarked on his second marriage, exchanging vows with Jilly, marking a fresh chapter in his life journey. This union symbolized a newfound beginning for Tom, following his previous marriage to Jacqueline from 1971 to 1982. Despite not having biological children, Tom demonstrated his unwavering commitment to family by embracing fatherhood through adoption, welcoming Jacqueline's son from a previous marriage into their lives. This early experience as a parent laid the foundation for Tom's subsequent role as a devoted father figure. His dedication to family only deepened with his second marriage to Jilly. In the same year that he bid farewell to Magnum P.I., Tom and Jilly joyously welcomed their daughter Hannah into the world, marking a significant milestone in their lives and ushering in a new chapter of love and happiness for the family. Following his departure from Magnum P.I., Tom made a deliberate choice to prioritize his family, relishing in precious moments spent away from the glare of the spotlight. With an inherent love for the outdoors, they immersed themselves in family-centric activities, forging cherished memories away from the public eye. This deliberate shift towards a more private life 
afforded Tom the opportunity to recharge and reconnect with his passions beyond the realm of acting. Despite his continued success on television, Tom remained steadfast in his preference for a quieter, more intimate existence. As Hannah came into their lives and Magnum P.I. concluded, Tom's familial bonds became the cornerstone of his existence, occupying center stage in his life. Tom's return to the limelight occurred in 1990 with his starring role in the successful Western film Quigley Down Under. His portrayal in the movie garnered widespread acclaim, showcasing his enduring talent and versatility beyond his iconic Magnum P.I. persona. This triumphant comeback reaffirmed Tom's prowess in the Western genre and his ability to excel in diverse roles. Following his success in Quigley Down Under, Tom continued to make waves in the movie industry throughout the 90s, captivating audiences with his compelling performances. However, one particular highlight of this era was his memorable guest appearance in the beloved sitcom Friends. Portraying the character of Richard Burke, Monica Geller's charismatic boyfriend, Tom showcased his versatility as an actor, effortlessly bringing charm and charisma to the role. His stint on Friends not only delighted audiences, but also introduced him to a new legion of fans, drawn to his infectious humor and undeniable talent. While his portrayal on Friends garnered widespread acclaim, Tom viewed it as a departure from his more serious cinematic endeavors, prompting him to take decisive action to realign his career trajectory. Determined to pursue his artistic aspirations with unwavering commitment, he made the bold decision to part ways with his agent, signaling his steadfast dedication to his craft and his desire to explore new creative horizons. As the new millennium dawned, Tom remained a prominent figure in showbiz, demonstrating his enduring relevance and versatility as an actor. However, it was in 2010 that he made a triumphant return to the small screen with the hit TV show, Blue Bloods. This pivotal role marked a significant milestone in his career, propelling him back into the spotlight and reaffirming his status as a television icon. In his role as Frank Reagan, the patriarch of a family of cops navigating the complexities of law enforcement in New York City, Tom Selleck brought depth and authenticity to the character, resonating deeply with viewers. His portrayal of this principled figure struck a chord with audiences, elevating Blue Bloods to the status of a television phenomenon. As Blue Bloods continued to captivate audiences season after season, it surpassed all expectations, solidifying its status as one of the longest-running cop dramas on television. With each episode, Tom's commanding presence as the lead character anchored the show, drawing viewers into the intricate world of the Reagan family and earning widespread acclaim from critics and fans alike. However, amidst the ongoing success of Blue Bloods, Whispers of Tom's potential retirement from acting began to circulate, casting a shadow of uncertainty over the future of the beloved series. Speculation about his departure intensified, fueled by rumors and conjecture about the actor's plans. While the prospect of Tom stepping away from the spotlight remains uncertain, one thing is undeniable, his indelible impact on the entertainment industry. In the serene backdrop of his California ranch, Tom Selleck finds solace amidst the gentle whispers of nature. Away from the bustling lights of Hollywood and the demands of his successful acting career, the ranch serves as his sanctuary, a haven where he can retreat to and reconnect with the simple joys of life. Here, amidst the sprawling expanse of his land, Tom cultivates a deep appreciation for the beauty of the natural world finding fulfillment in watching crops grow and tending to the earth. Despite the allure of fame and fortune, Tom remains grounded in his commitment to family, prioritizing quality time with his loved ones above all else. In the tranquil embrace of his ranch, he finds respite from the relentless pace of his hectic schedule, cherishing moments of quietude and reflection with those closest to him. For Tom, these moments of connection are invaluable, while his financial success affords him the luxury of stepping away from the spotlight.
Tom's passion for storytelling and acting continues to fuel his desire to return to the screen. It's not merely a quest for wealth or fame that drives him, but rather a genuine love for his craft and a desire to share his experiences with the world. Amidst rumors of retirement, whispers of a memoir emerge, hinting at the possibility of revealing insights into Tom's life and career, including rumored Hollywood romances from his illustrious past. Despite his striking appearance and the magnetic allure of Hollywood's glitzy gatherings, Tom Selleck has never quite felt at home amidst the dazzle of those glamorous parties. His inclination to eschew the flashy Hollywood scene in favor of a more subdued lifestyle speaks volumes about his commitment to authenticity and simplicity. Often described as an old-fashioned guy, Tom's actions consistently reflect his adherence to traditional values, underscoring his belief in the importance of prioritizing family, nature, and simplicity above all else. As Tom gracefully navigates the passage of time, many speculate about the possibility of his retirement from the spotlight. Yet, it appears that he has found a harmonious balance between his professional commitments and personal life. Unlike the frenetic pace of his days on Magnum P.I., Tom now approaches life with a more relaxed demeanor, savoring each moment with a sense of contentment and fulfillment. When questioned about the prospect of retirement, he remains steadfast in his dedication to Blue Bloods, expressing his intention to continue portraying Frank Reagan for as long as his fans remain engaged. As Blue Bloods prepares to embark on its 14th and final season, Tom Selleck finds himself grappling with the impending farewell to the beloved Reagan family. In an interview with TV Insider, Selleck expressed his reluctance to bid adieu to the long-running intergenerational cop drama. CBS will find an awful lot of people aren't ready to say goodbye to it, he remarked, highlighting the enduring popularity of the show, which has captivated audiences for nearly 15 years. The show's more popular than ever, and I think numbers will increase with the interest this year. We're certainly not out of ideas, Selleck added optimistically, hinting at the ongoing creative potential of the series. Despite the prospect of Blue Bloods concluding its run, Selleck's tone suggests a reluctance to part ways with a project that has been a significant part of his life since its inception in 2010. I'm not counting the days so I can do something else, he emphasized when asked about retirement. I love the work. Sometimes the hours are a little harder because I'm older. But so what? I want work as long as they'll have me, Selleck affirmed, underscoring his enduring passion for his craft. This sentiment echoes Selleck's previous expressions of dismay regarding the show's impending conclusion. Upon the announcement of Blue Blood's final season, Selleck penned a heartfelt message to fans, acknowledging the privilege of being part of a series that celebrates the valor of New York City's law enforcement while emphasizing the importance of family. For the past 13 years, it has been an honor and a privilege to work on a show that not only celebrates the men and women who protect and serve in New York City, but also displayed the importance of family, he wrote, expressing gratitude for the opportunity to collaborate with an exceptional ensemble over the course of more than 275 episodes. As the eagerly anticipated first half of Blue Blood's 14th season premieres on February 16th, fans brace themselves for the bittersweet culmination of a journey that has left an indelible mark on television history. With the promise of the second half slated for release later in the year, viewers remain poised to bid a fond farewell to the Reagan family even as they cherish the enduring legacy of a show that has touched hearts and captivated audiences for over a decade. In addition to his career milestones, Tom Selleck's journey is marked by his health struggles as he navigates his late 70s. Speculation has arisen regarding the actor's battle with what some reports describe as crippling arthritis, raising concerns about his well-being. Some sources have even suggested that Selleck may be grappling with an incurable disease and facing the possibility of going blind. These speculations gained traction, particularly in light of Selleck's appearances on Blue Bloods since its debut in 2010, where viewers have noted what appears to be a limp in his gait. Reports, 
including a notable one from the National Enquirer in 2019, have alleged that Selleck's mobility issues stem from severe arthritis that affects his movements and joints. Despite the buzz surrounding these claims, Selleck himself has chosen to remain tight-lipped about his personal health matters, opting to keep them away from the public eye. This preference for privacy has been a consistent aspect of Selleck's approach throughout his career. However, speculation regarding Selleck's health extends beyond arthritis. There have also been rumors surrounding his eyesight, with reports suggesting that the actor may be experiencing significant vision problems due to the long-term effects of medication for rheumatoid arthritis. The National Enquirer even mentioned a visit to an eye specialist in Los Angeles, sparking theories about potential diagnoses of conditions such as glaucoma and cataracts. These conditions could pose serious challenges to Selleck's vision and, in the worst-case scenario, could lead to blindness. Despite these alarming reports, a representative for Selleck has asserted that the actor is in excellent health, seeking to quell fears about his well-being amid these health concerns. However, there have been whispers about Selleck's future in the entertainment industry, particularly regarding his role in Blue Bloods and the possibility of retirement. The physical demands of filming, coupled with the challenges of managing a chronic condition, could understandably lead to discussions about stepping back from a demanding career in showbiz. However, both Selleck and his representatives have firmly denied any plans for retirement, indicating his commitment to continue working as long as he is able to do so. Selleck's approach to his career at this stage seems to reflect a broader philosophy of life that values perseverance, privacy, and a deep connection to his work and audience. Reflecting on a remarkable career, Selleck has been in the entertainment biz for over five decades now. At 79 years old, he's seen it all. He's not just about Hollywood glitz and glam. He's a seasoned actor with a legacy that goes way beyond that. This choice has probably kept him feeling good, both physically and in his personal life. Despite his age, Selleck continues to embody a passion for his craft and a dedication to his audience. His enduring presence in the entertainment industry serves as a testament to his talent and resilience. As he navigates the challenges of aging and managing his health, Selleck remains committed to his work, finding fulfillment in the art of storytelling and connecting with his audience. Despite the adoration of his fans, the entertainment industry remains unpredictable, a fact well understood by Tom Selleck, given his extensive experience. As the curtain falls on the long-running CBS series Blue Bloods after 14 successful seasons, veteran actor Tom Selleck is reportedly eager to embrace a slower pace of life on his sprawling 65-acre avocado farm outside Los Angeles. The 79-year-old, known for his portrayal of Frank Reagan on the show, is said to be looking forward to trading in the weekly commute to New York City for the tranquility of his rural retreat. Sources close to the actor revealed that Selleck, a devoted family man married to wife Jilly Mack since 1987, is eager to spend more time indulging in his passion for outdoor activities and reconnecting with loved ones. At his age, Tom wants more time to enjoy all the outdoorsy things he likes to do on the ranch, an insider shared with the National Enquirer, and he wants to spend more time with family. Despite his decades-long career in Hollywood, Selleck has always maintained a grounded perspective, prioritizing personal fulfillment over fame and fortune. Tom has more than enough money, and he's not attached to fame and the trappings that go along with it, the insider added. This retreat to his farm echoes a similar decision Selleck made in 1988 during the peak of his Magnum P.I. fame where he chose to step back from the limelight to focus on his personal life. Reflecting on that period, Selleck once remarked, I was tired, and I wanted a three-dimensional life because I didn't have one. I worked 90 hours a week and did a movie every break. For Selleck, the sanctuary of his avocado farm offers a sense of grounding and fulfillment that transcends the ephemeral nature of fame. My relationship and my ranch keep me sane, he remarked.
The farm, purchased from Dean Martin in 1988, has become a labor of love for Selleck, who personally tends to its more than 1,500 avocado trees. This ranch is a great counterpoint to the acting business, Selleck explained. You dig a hole and plant an oak tree, and I've probably planted a thousand of them. It's real. Embracing the simplicity and authenticity of farm life, Selleck finds solace in the tangible rewards of his labor. It's there, and you watch it grow, he noted. It's a lot different from being famous, and it keeps me sane. Despite the demands of maintaining the property, Selleck relishes the physical labor involved, often taking on tasks like cleaning horse stalls himself. He's got the power to decide when he's ready to leave acting behind and spend more time at his ranch. For Selleck, Hollywood wasn't solely about fame and wealth. It was about love, family, and the pursuit of happiness. Over the years, he grappled with fame's demands while striving for normalcy in his personal life. However, tragedy struck in 1987 when he lost his son Kevin to leukemia at just 22, leaving an irreplaceable void. The grief was overwhelming, prompting Selleck to reevaluate his life's priorities. He retreated from the limelight, focusing on family and finding solace in life's simple pleasures. Yet the pain of Kevin's loss lingered, a poignant reminder of life's fragility. Selleck's journey in entertainment, marked by iconic roles like Magnum P.I. and his portrayal of Frank Reagan in Blue Bloods, has captivated audiences worldwide. However, as retirement rumors circulate, fans feel a tinge of sadness. If he does step back, it would mark the end of an era. Yet, there's also a profound respect for Selleck's choices, driven by his commitment to family and storytelling excellence. Whether he continues acting or retires, Selleck's legacy is assured. What are your thoughts on Tom Selleck? Comment down below to let us know. And before you go, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel to support us. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.